Hey there everyone, this is MarkyMan64 here, welcome you back to another episode of Let's Play the Lego Movie Video Game on the PlayStation 4. This is episode number 15. So we are at the moment just gathering up our red bricks. Uh, that will make life easier for us when we get back into the levels to get the remaining things that we need to get from the levels. So at the end of the last episode I was standing here and I spotted what is behind us there so I'm just going to gather that up. All the things in these free play areas in, in between the levels appear to be uh, for red bricks pretty much so like all the collections and all the all the things that we need to do appear to be for the red bricks so for this one we can jump from the the building next to it but i am just going to come up and, and fly up and the pieces in there and then can he build? Can he do the, the build or does it have to be Emmett? Yes, I, th I thought any of the construction workers could do that. So this is this one? Yeah. Also, oh, is it going to be like a well that we're building? It looks like it. Uh, that one. And that one. That one. And that one. There we go. 13,000 seems to be the amount that I am getting in all these... <laughs> in all these these super builds. Whatever they're called. They're not called super builds, but whatever they're called. And am I going to be pulling up the red brick from inside the well? Yes. Okay. And this red brick... Now, the red bricks... Character studs? What what are character studs? I can't even think what character studs are. Is, are, they, are, they, are the characters out sending out studs all over the place? I don't know. What are they? <laughs> I, I don't know. But, yes, some of them are more or less useful depending on depending on, uh, you know, how, how how you play the game. And also, like, I mean, if you got the red brick detector as your last red brick, then it's obviously not as useful as it might have been before then. I'm just going to show you what happens when you come in here as another character. You can't go near where the, where the map... I keep calling it map piece. It's not map. Uh, the instruction page is you're not able to get anywhere close to it. Uh, okay, so what other level do I want to do? Because we have done quite a lot, <laughs> quite a lot of the the requirements. I'm not sure what other red bricks we still have to get. To be honest with you. I don't think there's that many. <laughs> uh, there is one here because I know there's at least one here. Yeah, yeah, there's two here and I, I know of one but I don't know where, like what you do with it or what you do to get it. Uh, how, what happens if I destroy this president business sign here? Let's be Unikitty and build whatever we're going to build. Oh, we've got one of three of them to build as well. So are they going to... Yes, they're going to dance along to music in their heads. <laughs> Which is not at all concerning, you know. Uh, okay, so let's be Emmett and let's fix this machine here. Am I getting electrocuted at the same time as I'm repairing? <laughs> that would be hilarious. <laughs> and not, not at all an efficient way of, of doing this. So is this going to make another platform or...? Okay, it's going to be a multi-step process it looks like. 
Oh yes, okay, so I'm going to then pull this down and let's be Wonder Woman for this. I think Wonder Woman did the last one, didn't she? So we've got five of them to bring down. I know I can imagine or picture what the the one is that's in that room there, but I can't think how to actually start it, how to activate it. Is it like up in the, the ceiling? I think it's up in the ceiling. So let me go round and try and get to a place where I can start that. Uh, okay. Oh, there's a few red bricks actually. There's quite a few red bricks. What is that on the wall? <laughs> why, why is it like shining like that? That's kind of weird. Okay, I was stuck on that table for a second there. So, is this? Yes, this is another of those posters. So some of them are just going to be on the wall ready to be pulled down. Some of them are going to need some finagling. That's the room that I go into from downstairs, but I don't know how that happens. <laughs> how that makes sense with perspective, but oh well. Uh, let's... Sorry if this is like, I don't know what this is like for viewers. I am enjoying this for this game. I, when I go into the levels, I will be doing what I normally do, which is like cutting to, you know, oh, like, join us in a second when I collect the next thing. Uh, probably more so than, than I am here, but it is going to... I like yeah this is this is getting into that level uh, but sorry if that's like if this isn't interesting for you because this this game is very different from some of the other ones that I've done recently just the way just like what the collectibles are that I'm collecting and oh yes it is it is that but I can't remember how to is it Green Lantern that needs to do this? Let's let's be Green Lantern and see if that's it's him that needs to do something about this. No? Okay. <laughs> I might need to look this one up. Oh, is it this? Do I need to activate this? Like I said, I can picture what yeah, okay. I can picture what it is that I'm doing. Yeah, that that was what I could picture. I could I could see that happening. I I'm guessing that Green Lantern needs to do something with that. No, maybe not. Okay, invincibility seems like a useful thing to to have on, especially for the levels. So let's have that on. But like, if it starts to get a bit boring or repetitive, then I will switch that off. So I don't think he. He has the ability to grab things, does he? Which doesn't really make sense, but anyway, let's become Diana again. <laughs> and let's pull that down. That's four of five. So I'm also needing to needing to get them to dance as well. Which there's not that much space to to do that wherever these platforms may well be. So I'll try and find them. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure Green, yeah, Green Lantern needs to do something with this. I was right. It was a Green Lantern thing. Okay, so what has that done? Is that not a Lord Business thing that's going to come up? Yes! Okay, I remember that. <laughs> right before it happens, I remember. Okay, so I see that there's a silver block over there. So, let's be a character that can do something about that. Can uh, Metal Beard do something about that? Now, this is Metal Beard minifigure, which is a bit different. No, it doesn't appear that he has missiles as that character. But yeah, you can't be like Metal Beard, like the, you know, the big 
character running about. Um, because that would break the game probably. But let's be... I, th I feel like I, I need to be Wonder Woman now with all of these. Because... Okay, I vaguely know where that is. It's up, up the stairs, right? Um... Yeah, like, I've, I felt as if I needed to be Wonder Woman there for, for all of them because she had started it. Okay, it's through here and then up here. It is a bit annoying that the red bricks show... What is what is this? It is annoying that the... Okay, that doesn't really matter because I've got invincibility on. That's fine. Uh, oh man, what am I saying? It is annoying that it shows the location for the red bricks here, but okay, that's doing the stuff, other stuff. Is this going to be something that I need to do for a red brick? Probably. It looks like it. It looks like that's going to be like one of those dance platforms. Let's go down there and build whatever it is I've got to build. Yes, have I finished this point already? It's annoying that it shows where the red brick is going to be, but doesn't give any hints as to, like, what... Yeah, okay. Where the... <laughs> okay, he got confused there. It doesn't give any hints as to what you need to do to, like, get the red bricks. It just shows where they are going to appear when you've done the thing. It's, they're not that complicated though. Like, it's, it is a bit of a... Yeah, it's so different from the other LEGO games that I've done, isn't it? Because with those, you... You got... Was it not like gold bricks? It was just like more gold bricks, wasn't it? In the, in the free play areas, like Jurassic World I'm talking about. That you got when you were like as the collectibles that you got as you were walking about. Okay, I'm just destroying these because these look like the platforms that they they were standing on, but I don't think they are. So one of them is dancing in here. One of them is is dancing. Where are the others dancing? They're in this room, aren't they? Okay, so one of them is dancing here. So I'm guessing that the the last one is not is not dancing in the same place. Um, is there anything up here? No, I've already been up here, haven't I? Are there any more of those screens that I need to interact with? Oh, here's a a point for one of the one of the wizards to go into. So, open this door up, get all these lovely studs, and okay, so that's how to how to go through here. <laughs> okay, that, that, that makes sense, that makes it easier. And I have just realised that this has repaired itself very quickly. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. They didn't, they didn't want to uh, close down or whatever. Let's go into the, the big room again to see if there's anything in there that I've missed in here. I don't think so. Because what I'm looking for now, right, is the is the last poster and then I'm looking for like a group of the robots because they are going to be doing be dancing when I set up their their platforms to dance. Oh, this is so that I can get back up here. Uh, ladders to get back up here. So that appears to be in that room. The the red brick that I've got to get. Let's go back in that room and see if there's anything else that I've got to collect. Yes, there does seem to be. Oh no, that's that's just arrows pointing outside. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, let's. Sorry, uh, this is not how I've normally done these, and 
I had done one of my let's plays I think was yeah like the Lego City Undercover was more like this where I was running about but this is very different from like what I was to collect in those games. So I'm just wanting to be Superman and then if I can't see it in the next little while then I will just look it up. That's, uh, that'll make it easy. So I can't see a platform for them to dance on and like I'm also looking for little groups of them because they're obviously going to be dancing wherever I'm setting this up. So nothing to do with these and then I've also got one more poster to, to do, have I not? Or have I done all the posters now? I can't remember. <laughs> okay. So it's nothing to do with these, I don't think. Okay, if it's if it's a case of I need to look it up, then I need to look it up. So give me two seconds, I'm going to quickly look these up and double check where they are. Okay, so it's amazing how these seem so obvious when you know where they are. So this one is back in this room and I can see the group of the robots that I'm going to need to influence to make them want to dance. Where where, where am I now? <laughs> am I not? Yeah. Can I go back out here? Do I need to go back out here? It's okay. It's okay. So she's going to come in and build this platform and there we go. Three of three. So the, the red brick is where it's been pointing at, but it's nice and close. It's quite funny that Unikitty appeared to be like looking towards the red brick. <laughs> so regenerate hearts, which again, there's no point in having that because I have invincibility, but hey, <laughs> that's okay. Um, and for the last one, I don't know why I didn't do this because Earlier on I got this platform and I was like, I remembered that it was Lord Business. And I don't know why I then didn't do anything with it. So I've got to come over here, flick the switch, and then that turns off these lasers and you can already see where the red brick is. So if I come up here, drop down, and here is, this, I think it's maybe the second last red brick that I've got to collect in the whole game. So then I don't know what would happen if I went elsewhere. Uh, with, with Lord Business being Lord Business as opposed to President Business. I don't know whether it just wouldn't transport or something, but anyway. I need to go back to Cloud Cuckoo Land because I've got one more still to get here and I did try to see it but I don't think I knew what character to get and I still don't 100% know what character to get for this but I need a character that can set a fire so a few of the characters fit that a bill I don't know if... Can Metal Beard do it? No. Okay. I know some of the criminal characters can do it. But I don't know... I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know what, like, what... What you're looking out for in this. And there's no way in this to... View... Can... Gordon Zola? Yes, okay, he can set a fire because he's a chef. But I don't know what you're looking out for and in this game, unlike some games, there's no way to view the special ability of characters or like categorise them. So you kind of just need to know <laughs> or guess. <laughs> so was one of them, yeah, one of them was over here. And then the other one was up in one of the rooms. I think at the, the start, the thing that you climb up 
the ladder that you climb up in the start room. I think it was over there and oh, okay. <laughs> that's, that's not so invincible now. So it's over here, isn't it? It's like up, up this ladder, but can he climb up the ladder? Yeah. Okay. You don't need to be a female character to climb up a ladder. Good to know. So this, this may well be the last of the red bricks. We'll, we'll double check that when we go into the menu to accept it, but fast boomerangs. So this will be for, for Batman, see if we, if we first of all switch it on. So if we go through them, it does appear that, yes, that's all the red bricks. Congratulations to us, and we could have just paused it and looked in the top, in the bottom left hand corner there to see 20 of 20. <laughs> oh well. So, resume, and if we switch to Batman, let's see what Fast Boomerang does. I don't know whether you can actually, like, do it with, like, just throwing the boomerang and, like, hitting all these objects, or whether it's. It may just be for when you're throwing it at enemies and stuff. But, yeah, fair enough. Okay, so we are now ready <laughs> to, to go into the, the levels because we've got all the, all the red bricks uh, and we, you can see that we only have two of the 15 of the pants and we have 13 of 75 of the the gold what what is it called again gold gold instruction page gold instruction page and i did that in a weird order because we've then got the the last one there is 33 of 70 of the gold bricks which obviously you get by getting the other things and we've got 6 of 15 of the of the the awesome is that is that what it's called <laughs> i've suddenly forgotten <laughs> everything is awesome uh whatever it's called that thing down the bottom middle here uh so i am going to go into the first level which is back at bricksburg isn't it so let's see I think that's, is that the only way to, to reload the levels, is to go into them from over here? I'm trying to think where the first level would be, or even what it was. Uh, the first level was in the construction site, wasn't it? Because it was putting together the construction things. Wow, that seems like a while ago, but it really wasn't. This this let's play is going to be quite a bit shorter, I think, than some of them have been. It's not as long a game. I don't perceive it then anyway as as long a game. So Bricksburg construction, and we are going into free play. Where'd you leave it this time? And. Let's pick our character, let's pick Superman, just because he can fly, and flying is cool. <laughs> okay, so there we go. So we have already got the special from just standing still, and obviously like the attract studs thing comes up, and so the first thing we need to do or one of the things we need to do is destroy these cameras, which let's destroy this one over here. I think there's a five of them. I, I've not noticed the number come up, but I believe there's five of them. And the first, the first thing we can do is actually like round here. There's a few of the the gold instruction pages in this area around here. But we need to become Lord Business over here. And I think, is he? Yes, he's one of our characters. So if I press the uh, R1, L1 buttons, that switches the characters quickly when you're in the levels. 
and he can walk through the spire for some reason and I suppose his legs are fake so <laughs> I suppose in that way <laughs> that makes it easier but then yes there is the golden page and if we walk through there actually like he is good for destroying these buildings as well which you have to destroy 11 of them and you can see just the number of studs that I'm picking up <laughs> from doing this because there's so many like blue studs and I have attract studs on and obviously all the multipliers so yeah the levels are really a good place to go for for studs obviously I wasn't going to do that to grind for studs because I was wanting to make that a separate thing and really like these levels are so short that I'm not sure for most of them whether like leaving and then coming back like I have done in previous LEGO games is is the the best approach either because like they're really yeah so there we go we've got a gold page of instructions for doing that. Let me go back to turn back into a normal character because I don't think there's anything else in this area but then there is other things in this area so I want to I want to investigate why or what what happens with these things over here. So I'm guessing if I become a character that can pull this stuff. Yeah, if you if you don't have a, an appropriate character for these then don't worry about it. Like you can just switch to any character and that's a good thing about this game uh, which isn't present in all the games. So switch to Batman. Pull these. I'm guessing that he's going to be pulling the, the PCs to fix this. Yeah. But I don't know what happens when you push this in because I don't think it's, it's any of the gold bricks or anything. Not gold bricks, whatever they're called. <laughs> so what does that do? What has that done? Is that then able, yeah, you're then able to climb up there. Let's be Gale and let's climb up here and see what is up here. Is it just this purple stud? I think it's just for that purple stud, right? <laughs> okay, fair enough. I knew that it wasn't anything because I, like, I didn't see that in any of the instructions for this level. Oh, so that reloads this as well. Okay, fair enough. Uh, there's no more cameras down here, is there? No. He's got one of the pages in his hand. Did you see that? <laughs> okay, so let's repair this. And again, it looks like Gail is being electrocuted while she's repairing that, which I think is absolutely hilarious <laughs> but yes we are just going through the level as as intended but I don't think there's anything bad with that <laughs> like I'm, I'm struggling to find anything wrong with that let's destroy these toilets <laughs> just 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 because uh, okay so building Building at this stage is a bit of a joke because you just need to add one tree, <laughs> which is this tree. <laughs> I suppose you need to choose what tree, like, <laughs> what tree goes there, but it is that tree. So, then I can't remember what happens. They lift this building, don't they, and then, yeah, move it over there into a new area. Okay, and then let's first of all find find any security cameras. So that is finding the security cameras with the arrows. I can see that. Let's get Batman to destroy this. And how many is that that we've got now? Is that a uh, three now? And then are the other ones going to be on the other side there? Okay, so he isn't going to be able to do that, but Gail is. She's going to be able to repair that. Open this door, come in here, get the 
the drill, even though we have the drill, you need to, to go in and get it. And there is an arrow, the arrow's pointing over there and I'm concerned in case we have forgotten one of the security cameras. Maybe in that, in that extra place, I don't know. If, if we need to come back, it's not the end of the world if we need to then come back to the level, but I would just cut obviously to when we get it, if that was the case, because I don't think you can go back to where we were. Okay, now that I know that the roads are included and the, everything is included in this house, this, this becomes a lot easier. So is he going to... yeah, he lets us in there because we have helped him destroy that building, right? Is that is that what went on there? So let me see if there's any cameras. There is this thing back here. There is a camera there. So let's destroy this camera and how many is that that we've got now? I don't like that I I've not been able to see the number come up and I don't like that there's an arrow pointing back back there it looks like yeah it's like back there somewhere it's like up the top of the screen now okay we'll, we'll see because we might be going back there I can't remember what what happens with this to be honest with you uh, let's push this in here and wake up that person I think that, that is. Uh, let's be Gale. I don't think I actually used the drill for Gale while we were playing this level. But then push that down there. And push that in. Perfect. And then there's one of the pages, so the other page is just up the top and we'll get that naturally when we go up. But... The next one... Is... Well, there's a, there's a gold page behind that rainbow wall. I know that I'm kind of spoiling by saying that, but there is. <laughs> Uh, so let's be one of the Unikitties and destroy these rainbow bricks. Get that. And how, how do we fix this up again? What do we do? Is it this? Yeah, it's this, isn't it? And then be Unikitty. No. Hang on. Why, why is... <laughs> Why is she not going on to the conveyor belt? Oh, okay. Unikitty, I need you to go on to that. Okay, I need to become Unikitty, go on to that, and then be Gale again, move this up. Okay, and then be, be Unikitty. Where is she? Okay, there she is. And then be one of the characters other than Gale who can fix this because if I become Gale then I'll just appear back down there again. So I'm a bit concerned because like I think I missed out one of the cameras and I don't think it saves. I don't think unlike uh, when you're in free play, when you're in the levels, I don't think this saves. Okay, that's him saying that the people are in for their coffee break and they're not leaving. But yeah, that doesn't make any noise when it's it's in the free play. Oh there you go, okay. I I, I thought I'd missed out one of the cameras. So plug this in and maybe you can remember what was happening, but he was needing to activate these to... How, what is the mini kit? Yeah, okay, so I have got quite a lot of level to play, but I might skip forward to when, I, when I'm when i going through the tunnel, 
later on because I need to get that, but like it's yeah. Let's skip forward to when I when I'm going through the tunnel and you'll understand what I mean when we get there. Give me two seconds. Okay, I got 17 awesome there. I just wanted to point that out because I, like I said when I was recording one of these dance routines, or even both of them, I, I hear slightly out of sync, like a millisecond out of sync, which really puts you off when you're, when you're playing that, but I just like overcompensated for it. But anyway, yes, I'm going to skip forward again to where I go down the tunnel, and I don't mean this tunnel, I know that I didn't describe that very well, but I mean after the cutscene when uh, Emmett sees Wildstyle for the first time, he goes down the tunnel and that's where he finds a piece of resistance and stuff, but I'm going to skip forward to when I'm going down there and that is that is where I'm going to find the, the final mini kit, hopefully. And I know I could just call it a mini kit. I'm going to probably continue to call it mini kits, but I mean the uh, golden page instruction page. But skip forward to that. Okay, so I'm going down the tunnel now, and I'm not a hundred percent sure what I like where I have to go. <laughs> I I do know like where I have to go. All uh, like first of all, but. I don't know exactly, like it's in one of the, the circles of studs, I know that much, but I'm not 100% sure where where that is. Now I think it's after this thing, the side on thing, I think you press a button, I think it's a prompt, is it, yes, there we go, okay. So I'm going down the right way, I just need to find the... One that has the the one that has the the mini kits inside it, and don't get distracted by the studs because I'm picking them up anyway. <laughs> Falling down here. Oh, okay. The arrow is pointing towards it, and is it in the middle of this? No, it's in the middle of this. There we go. Okay, so that's five out of five of the gold page instructions and there we go so bricksburg construction level complete and we got yeah <laughs> a lot of studs look at that <laughs> we have over two billion studs now which is great <laughs> the numbers just keep going up and up and up uh and yeah it's quite fun how that's like it is calculated you know like <laughs> I'd love to at some point like get to take the multipliers off and then get a round number and then like that would then be round as as I turn the multipliers back on. So we ha we have the special, we have five out of five of the gold pages, and so we get another gold brick for getting the I think it's the special, right? The uh, getting that. And so we are going to leave it there folks, join us again for another episode of Let's Play the Lego Movie Video Game on the PlayStation 4. Please like, comment, subscribe for more. Thanks everyone for watching, see you later, bye bye.